the AI bubble just popped. Let me tell you a very interesting story. In the 90s, the internet arrived like a tidal wave. Suddenly, every company wanted to call itself an internet company. Most of them weren't even making money. Actually the opposite, they were burning millions of dollars. But the hype was so intense that the stock prices kept shooting up. But after the 2000s, people realized that these companies are entirely running on investor money. And when the investors stopped paying them, the companies crashed immediately. This is what is known as the infamous dot-com bubble. And today we are seeing something quite similar with AI. Many of these companies are operating at massive losses and they are being valued in the billions and even trillions. An MIT report even suggests that 95% of this generative AI startups won't survive the next five years. If you look closely at this ecosystem, this is like a vicious cycle. AI companies invest billions on each other, buying from each other, and this cycle inflates valuation across the entire industry. And sitting right in the center of this giant bubble is NVIDIA, the company whose chips have basically become the engine of AI revolution. But most people don't know that NVIDIA doesn't really manufacture these chips. They just design them. And the manufacture of these chips are done by a company called TSMC, which is in Taiwan. And Taiwan sits in one of the most geopolitically sensitive regions in the world. China can basically decide to attack Taiwan in any time. Nearly every major AI company depends completely on TSMC. So if anything happens to Taiwan, even temporarily, it could crash the whole AI industry overnight. That's how fragile this global AI market is. Some argue that US will never allow this to happen. Others believe as the global economy depends on it, countries will come forward to prevent any conflict. Maybe they're right. But that doesn't change the fact that the most advanced and hyped technology in the world is sitting on the heart of the most geopolitically risky region or country in the world.